Alright, just sharing real quick. You guys, I've seen this one younger kid past couple days. I went down to the, uh, like the beach area when I did a little live video. And then, um, just now, I seen him again at the end of my road as I came in. And it was just bothering me. I was like, you know, it's, it's like every time I see him, he's sitting around like doing nothing. And it just bothered me, and I wanted to say something to him. I wanted to witness to him. So what I did was uh, I just, you know, just left from down there to talk to him. And uh, sadly, I wasn't able to talk to him because he was deaf. He can't hear, but I believe he could see. I asked him if he could read, and I gave him a few things for reading. And I pointed up in the sky, and I said, the Lord's coming, he's, and he went, yes, like he knew it, and uh, gave him a little card, too, a gift card, and, uh, and you know, he just kind of tried to say thanks, and then he smiled and waved like he knew, you know, I mean, <clears throat> yeah, I wish I could have talked more, you know, and, uh, but I see him out there sometimes, you know, I've been living here since 2018. And uh, I asked, at first I thought, I said, did Cynthia talk to you? And he's like, you know, deaf. Now, if Cynthia had to talk to him, she would have told me he was deaf. And, uh, and I don't believe she had. But anyhow, um, I'll let her know. Anyhow, when I see her, to let her know. Because I've seen him a couple times, and I've seen him at the end of our road. Not this road, but before you get out to the main road. Uh, so I know, I think he lives someplace around here. I just don't know. And he's maybe 17, maybe. You know, could be 16, could be 17 in that area. And, uh, you know, and then being deaf, you know. You know, especially in these times, you know. But uh, anyhow, he's yeah. He looked at me like he knows, and that's good. That's good. You know. Anyhow, what a time, huh? See these times coming right now, and uh, anyhow. I, that, that was the best that I could do because I didn't know any other way of talking to him. You know? And I tried to just tell him slowly, hope, hoping he could maybe read the lips. You know? That the Lord is coming. You know? And gave him a... like a little Bible thing, app thing like to read. <clears throat> and a little card where you can go get a sandwich. You know, but like I said, you know, he said he knows, you know, so I feel better anyhow. Like I said, I came into the place, fixed lunch, and it was just bothering me because I seen him the other day down there by the river where everybody, the beach, where the beach is like. I seen him sitting there like he was just lonely by himself. And I was doing the live video and I didn't say anything. And then I ended up leaving. Then I seen him again today at the end of the road. And I'm going, I got to talk to him. You know, I seen him twice now. And uh, he's been by himself. And we'll see. We will see. All right, you guys, stay strong, stay bold. In the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We got several dogs around here, man. They just kind of. <clears throat> they act like they're all in control here. Running the neighborhood, you know. But they keep the bears away, you know. They do do that. Anything that you see a bear coming up or anything like that, they bark. They keep everything pretty well clear of it. And, uh. We got a few bears around here. There's no doubt about it. I haven't seen one yet, but Cynthia has. And when Cynthia seen it, she, <laughs> she put a big old 
billboard sign out here in front of the mailbox going, there's a bear in this area, you know? Caution, there's a bear. Yeah, I know there's bears out here. I've never seen one, but she has. And our neighbor over here told me there's one back here someplace and another one over here someplace. In other words, they're around here. So these dogs do serve a purpose. We just, you know, we got to have, you know, if they're going to have dogs around, they just got to get along. You know, I mean, because they all run around. You don't want a dog running around that's just mean, you know. And that's why a lot of people, they, uh, they try to give treats to some of these animals. You know, they'll give little treats to them, just try to keep them friendly. Anyhow, be strong, you guys. God bless everybody. In Jesus Christ, our Lord and our Savior. And uh, things are going to start happening, man, in ways most people ain't ready for it. You know, things are going to start happening where uh, it's you know, it's going to happen suddenly. You know, a madness, like a drunk, you know, like, you know, dealing with somebody that's drunk. They've been drinking the, the wine of madness. You know, that's what they've done. They don't realize when you turn away from the Lord, um, you're going to be stricken with madness, you know? All right, you guys. God bless everybody in Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior.